it may thus cry some more, Gold Star family of soldier killed by suicide bomber during Veterans Day run get booed by American Airlines first class for delaying flight on way to pick up their dead son's body. The grieving father of a well-decorated Army soldier killed in Afghanistan says his family was booed by first-class passengers for delaying a flight to meet his son's remains. Sergeant John Perry, 30, died on Saturday at Bagram Airfield when he stopped a suicide bomber from reaching his target, a soldier's 5K Veterans Day run to benefit disabled veterans. His father, Stuart Perry, says his son, who was a combat instructor, and the others who died are heroes, as they may have saved more than 100 people's lives by stopping the bomber from reaching his target. The father, who is a Marine veteran, said he and his wife, Kathy and daughter, Anita, were flying on an American Airlines flight from Sacramento to Philadelphia with a quick transfer in Phoenix on Monday, the record reported. From Philadelphia they traveled to Dover Air Force Base in Delaware to receive his son's remains. Perry said the family's flight to Phoenix was 45 minutes late and the crew on board feared the delay may cause them to miss their connecting flight and miss their son's arrival at Dover. Once the plane landed in Phoenix, the captain made an announcement for everyone to stay seated and to let a special military family exit the aircraft first. The heartbroken father said that several passengers seated in first-class food and complained. Some people were saying this is just baloney, and I paid for first class for this," Perry told the newspaper. It was just disgusting behavior from people in first class, it was terrible to see. You could see the disappointment from the flight crew. He said American Airlines did everything they could to accommodate his family. The family made the connecting flight in Phoenix as the next pilot stayed at that gate for 40 minutes so they could make it on board.